I'm going to read you Clifford's First Halloween by Norman Bridwell. Clifford's First Halloween. Trick or treat! I'm Emily Elizabeth, and this big red clown is my dog Clifford. Clifford was not always this big. Many Halloweens ago, he was just a tiny puppy. I wanted to take Clifford out trick or treating, but the mask and the hat didn't fit. He was not a happy clown. I tried dressing him as an angel. While I was putting on my fairy costume, he ate his halo. <laughs> then I found the perfect costume for my small red puppy. Clifford was the littlest ghost I'd ever seen. My neighbors were nice. We both got lots of good treats. I showed Clifford my Halloween noisemaker. He was surprised. Then it was time for the party. All my friends came. Mommy made us candy apples. Clifford wondered how they tasted. Mm, the candy was sort of sticky. I had to give Clifford a quick bath. It was time to go to the haunted house. Our jack-o'-lantern looked very spooky. <gasps> Clifford followed me into the haunted house, but he didn't like it very much. Then Mommy dimmed the lights and told a scary story about a haunted hand that crept around the house. Suddenly we all saw a giant hand wriggling on the wall. We were scared. <gasps> Who was it? The hand came closer and closer. We laughed when we saw it was only Clifford. It was a great party. Clifford has grown up now, but he still makes every Halloween a special day for everyone. The end. I think that's a good one about Clifford. And there's little Clifford right now. Hi there, little Clifford. Happy Halloween, everyone.